what's up and welcome back to my channel now today I'm going to be giving a review for the NECA Batman 1989 grapnel launcher replica now of course this is a replica of the grapnel that uh, Batman used in the 1989 Tim Burton film which I do have on a uh, DVD right here now I must, sit, I must admit I'm definitely excited about having this particular uh, replica too because I also have that uh, Batarang replica too which they have which I thought was awesome too as well but this right here I managed to find this on the uh, NECA eBay store because I was actually having trouble finding this like in stores I knew it was already out like months ago but I really was having like a lot of trouble finding this particular uh, replica but then I found it like on a NECA eBay store because like I mentioned like in kind of other videos like NECA has put back up their store and they got like a lot of their products back up again so you can actually order from like their NECA store like on eBay so that's how I was actually able to pick this on up so I am definitely excited by having this and I'm going to get into it right now so this is the box that contains the uh, NECA grappling gun launcher grappling launcher replica so as you can see, this is how it looks. And I love this packaging that NECA does for these. Even for like the uh, battery that they, they had. It looks beautiful. I really love like, this packaging of the uh, replica. I mean of the grappling gun. And as you can see, it has it on the side too as well. At the top sides. It even shows, you know, that this would take batteries too. So this actually even has batteries that you could use in it. Now on the back it has like a image of like the grappling gun too as well and it shows you how you can like shoot off the uh the, the grappling itself. Now these are some of the things it says on the back too. It says uh handle unfolds outward for the grappling gun. It has like a retract thing where you, after you shoot it, reset by securing grappling into the locking cylinder and launch grappling. So those are just basically how you uh, will operate the grappling launcher. So I'm going to go ahead and get into this right now. But I really do love this packaging. I think that is awesome. That is beautiful. <laughs> this is how the grappling launcher looks inside too. Once you open it, you can see it right there. It even has instructions too for it. Which I think is awesome because this is kind of rare for NECA. Them having instructions because they tell you how to put the batteries in. And other things too as well. And how to shoot, shoot off the... Uh, the grapple launcher too as well so I think it's pretty cool okay. now this is how it look too once you take it out it's actually just like hanging like this already because you will have to retract this uh, grapple thing right there so what you got to do is actually put the batteries up here in this compartment rail right which I would do then this is how it looks like on the inside once you have it out I must admit I had trouble getting that off. Like this actual top, because the whole part of it like like pops off. So I actually had tr <laughs> trouble doing that. Now this takes uh when you look on the box, even right here it says uh, on the uh, instructions, it says that it takes uh two LR1 batteries. Now these right here what I have are like from Energizer and they're in batteries and they're equivalent to uh, LR1 batteries because that's how you find out what LR1 batteries are if you can't find a particular battery you find like it's equivalent and that's for here uh, it's N which is known as N I think it's another version too that they have basically these are like the same size just has like a different name but the ones I'm using are Energizer N okay I put the batteries inside the ground for launcher and as you can see that's how it actually looks now what I want to do is uh, measure it and see how long it is. So it's like from like the actual the grapple thing. It's like it's about 9 inches. Completely tight from one end to the other end. So I'm going to talk about the likeness and the detail of it. Now I know it isn't 100% like completely accurate. Because I know that I think from what I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, this right is like silver. But other than that, uh, certain other things about it, I really think it's a fine piece. I would have definitely picked this up. This is even probably one of my top favorite uh, NECA, I guess you could say, like, uh, collectibles of the year. I really like how this look. Even, like, the way this, like, uh, over here is painted, like, that gold, that really looks good. I like how it shines and stuff. It really looks beautiful. You can turn around and see this right here, too, as well. So it's not 100% accurate. And you really have to notice it to know that it isn't, you know. Then you also can, uh, if you look right here, you can look at this right here and flip it on out like that. And it'll lock into place. 
and then you actually got like a handle right here for like holding it as you can see but you don't really need that you can just still like hold it like this too like that if you want but I think it's cool now they don't give us like a stand for this like nothing they just give you like this right here like this you know you just have to prop it like this and it does stand up though which is interesting I think that's kind of cool so yeah <laughs> And it has like uh, this trigger here which you would match for here and it would actually shoot this uh this uh grapple out of stuff right here, it would shoot that out. I would need something to try it first though because I wanna shoot it on out, you know. Now I just try to shoot this off and I try to put something in front of it. I use the actual instructions paper and as you can see I have bust a hole in it right now. Uh -huh. it's, 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 it's okay though. I was just testing how far I would actually shoot. So what I'm gonna do is actually just shoot this on out like right now, just to give an example of how it looks. It does shoot far too. So let me see. So as you can see it shoots very far. You can see how long long it is right here, as you can see. Then what you would do, and that, that's how you shoot it too at the bottom right there, like this trigger thing right there. It seems kinda hard too, like you would break it if you're not careful. That's what shoots it out, but then this button up here is what retracts it, and that's what the batteries were for. So as you can see, I'm retracting it. Then once it get about right there, I know I probably won't be shooting off that much. You would just take it, and you gotta turn it kind of like that. Then push it in, and it will lock in. So yeah, I think this is awesome. Now, I will probably really never use that, like the uh, shooting like thing, like to shoot it out. I just probably have it like on display like that. I think that really is beautiful. That is awesome. <laughs> now what I want to do is compare it with the uh, NECA Batman 1989 Batarang which I have right here. Now of course this actually came with a stand as you can see. And this is another very cool collectible from NECA. And of course you know you can take it off the stand. Then it also even folds up too as well. But I just wanted to give like a comparison with it you know. Still noticing that looks like a 3 too. But yeah, this is like another uh, cool accessory from uh, NECA. I like that they gave us a stand with it too, but this doesn't have a stand. But it stands on its own though, as you can see. But I think these are some cool collectibles uh, from NECA. Then I, know, I also know that NECA's got like a, a third uh, Batman 1989 like grappler thing. It's the one that he used like in a museum. I think they call that like the gauntlet. Because it's like larger too, but it hasn't been like released yet. But I know that one is on the way too as well. Okay, that's the NECA Batman 1989 Grapple Launcher Replica. I think this is awesome. And it's not 100% accurate because there are like a couple of details in it that NECA is missing. Like certain areas of this have like silver on it and so on. But it is still really like an awesome piece. I really think they did a good job on this. A very uh, recommended uh, replica for my pen. Like I said, I had trouble finding this too. It was already out for like months, but I was actually having trouble finding it in certain places, and you know, and so on. But NECA eventually put it like on the uh, NECA eBay store, which is like kind of back up, and they got like a lot of products back up like it used to be. And that's why I was actually able to uh, find this particular uh, collectible. Now, of course, this is based on the 1989 Batman film by Tim Burton, which I have it on DVD. But yeah, I would definitely recommend picking this one up. And again, I know that NECA has another. Um, collectible from uh, Batman 1989 it's like the actual the, the gun the grapple I don't know if that one's actually called that he actually used in the museum he even used it at the end of the film too I believe when it was falling from like the church and he got shot it out right now when he's following Vicky Vale but uh, that one's on the way too as well but it hasn't been released and it looks like large I think that's the one that will actually go on your arm too you know but yeah I think this is amazing and another thing too this is actually my favorite gadget of Batman, not I ain't gonna say this particular version, but just the grapple gun period. As far as like all his gadgets, like the batarangs and so on, stuff like that. The grappling gun is my favorite uh, gadget of Batman, and I know he didn't always have that either. You know, that was kind of introduced in uh, the Batman film, and not really. It was actually introduced like in uh, Frank Miller's uh, The Dark Knight Returns. That's the first time he ever used like a gun and shot out a rope. Was in that particular uh, comic store or graphic novel. But yeah, I think this is definitely worth uh, picking on up. This is awesome, you know. So this is the NECA 
Batman 1989 Grappler Launcher Replica. I would definitely recommend this. Please leave a comment and uh, subscribe too as well. See that thing on my belt? Whatever you do, don't let go. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da